Hello everyone, Priest Scooter here. Welcome back to more Chuck Rock. Things have gotten grim. It is the end of days. Wow. That was gruesome. But yes, it's the end of days. Primordial oozes. Dragons. Things mostly dead. We're in our post-game at this point, folks. Also, everything needs to die. It's murdering me. I can't get back up now. Bones are worth points. Interesting. Oh. Right, some of those guys actually come back and attack you. I forgot about that. That minor detail. Oh, if they're angry, they'll come after you. <sighs> oh. You know, I just forgot how bizarre the game gets at this point, so you have to forgive me if I just go, oh, or ah, things like that. The game just gets a little bit on the wacky side, even for my tastes. Eh. Don't come after me. And now, are you an evil one? Yes, you are. It's just safe to assume to belly bump everything. Also, I'm going to need points, because I'm... I haven't used my continue yet, but I'm... Well, as you can see, I've come to the end of my lives. So my end of days is nigh. Also, I'm just throwing this everywhere. Okay, good. He's a good dinosaur. Damn it. Fine, come after me. Then don't come back. I'm going to ask you not to come back. Okay. Haha! -ha! I have a large rock. You cannot defeat me. For it is a large rock. Okay, good. You're going up. Oh, this area. I don't remember too much about this area because I've really only been here once, effectively. And when I got here, I pretty much was like, okay, it's having her hell time, let's do it, and extra life. So yeah, I gotta do is just make sure you pick up all the, get all the big pickups, and you're pretty much a guarantee to win. Also, you're gonna be an issue in a second, so let's get rid of you. Hey yeah. Yeah, what's up? You spat your teeth at me, now what are you gonna do? Hey yeah. Oh yes, this is the part I know, I remember more, most about this part, is we go inside of a dinosaur for part of the stage inside of him and see all the dying things and also his heart which I think this guy's got multiple hearts too so we're gonna see that enemy reoccurring but it's all worth it for the points and also it's gonna be worth it for the death in the second year that, that, that's that's not how stomachs work oh god oh god get off of his insides Uh, I couldn't jump over it. Damn. <sighs> I remember this area in specific giving me a lot of trouble. Just because of enemy placement. How much you cannot avoid being hit hits, really. It's a it's a giant grudge match at this point. There is a tactic to beating the boss at the end, though. Which, you should probably be able to tell... You should probably know who the boss is at this point. Okay, that didn't help me at all. What the hell? There we go, we're through. I think we're pretty much out, as long as I don't mess it up with the next couple seconds here. There, you will not harm me. And we're out, and is it boss time? It is boss time! Now, I don't remember how to fight this guy, or where you have to hit him. Continue. I think it's... Uh, yeah, it's a kick to the head. It's basically a back and forth motion like this. I might use up all my lives doing this too. He's difficult too, if you don't know this pattern. And I might still die. 
Yeah, there's a good chance I was gonna die still. It's like you have to do a quick fake out with them. I had the timing there for a minute. But yeah, his head is his weak spot, of course. Like it is with most bosses. I got it. No, I had it. I had the timing, but I forgot it. Let's hope I don't have to... Actually, wait. Just so I don't have to do it, pardon me for a moment. Okay. I'm back. As you saw, I did a little bit of cheating there. Probably, you probably saw that. I basically don't want to have to redo the whole game to get to the final fight, so I made a quick save. You're probably hearing my controller clicking like crazy over here. Because I'm actually fighting him really hardcore. This guy is actually really difficult considering what everything else was, basically just an endurance match. Alright, hold on, let me load state. Ah. Damn. Ah. I this is really the only strategy I know of. If you have a better strategy, I say video response me on it. You know, make a response to this video saying how awesome you are, Chuck Rock. Because that's gonna happen. Oh my god, this boss kicks my ass. Apparently, you know, I didn't have this technology back when I was five of load states. So what you're seeing here is basically me playing through the game again without having to... Without having to worry about repeating the game again. Damn. Damn. Oh, I remember countless hours of doing this as a kid. It's just grunt, just enduring the pain of sweaty hands and crunched thumbs of fighting King T Rex. I think is his name, King Tyrannosaur. Damn. Ah, I stayed put too long. Might have a pattern here. Might have a pattern here. Bait him in for the hit, and then pull back. Except if I, if I go too far left first. Oh, I got him! I got him! I killed him? Do I just have to go down there and nail him again? Okay. Well, that's it. That's the end of Chuck Rock. King Gar Gary. His name is Gary. Meow. Oh, good lord. Okay. Well, ten minutes of that boss fight later. That was a really quick let's play, actually. Really quick. And I'm sorry if it was a little too quick for your liking, folks, but... I wanted to do a Let's Play Chuck Rock without it being a one-day thing and for you guys to enjoy it as much as I enjoyed growing up. So I figured this is probably the best of two evils. And oddly enough, there is a sequel to this game, if you would believe it. But that might have to tackle another time, because I never played that. Um, but yes. This... Uh, excuse me. This has been Chuck Rock for the Genesis. And I really hope you enjoyed it as much as I... Wow, the credits loop. So I hope you enjoyed it as much as I as I did growing up, guys. Uh, if, there might be something different coming up with the next uh, set of uh, Let's Play videos for Sunday. And I'll try and keep it a shorter game, kind of like this one, but no promises. Anyway, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you next time.